I'm not even gonna lie. This vlog is of is that a rough is it's starting at a rough start. It's um brick it's mad brick outside, yo. And um I don't wanna be vlogging right now. It's so mad brick, yo. It's so mad brick, yo. It's mad brick outside, yo. Y'all, today is January 28th, Thursday. It is 7.55. I'm finally moving into a college dorm. I don't know what God's timing was on, but we weren't on a typical timeline with this. Yeah, guys, I... Guys, let me tell you about how I feel. I am excited, nervous, terrified, scared, ecstatic, terrified, anxious, happy, terrified. You know when you expect something and then it actually happens and you're like, no, when you, you know when you lower your expectations of something? Oh my gosh. You know when you just like get to a place where you're like, well, okay, I just gotta wait for that. Then you get it out of nowhere and you just don't know how your meter feels anymore. Like your gauge of like emotions is just different. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> but for those of you guys who are new, I don't even wanna talk about it. I'm just so tired. I'm tired. <laughs> I feel like I have like maybe 30 seconds of actual usable content right now. <laughs> 30 seconds, maybe 45. I'm literally driving myself to college. I got my driver's license last week. That made me feel a little bit better. There's so many questions from, I have so many questions for myself as to why I'm doing this, but Ultimately, I feel like this is God's plan, not mine. You know? And all I want out of this semester and out of this experience is to feel like I got some type of experience from it, growth from a new place, and just, you know, overall health and safety. Like, we are still in the middle of a pandemic. I'm very much aware of that. And I am moving. So, yeah. <sighs> I am ahead of the game, but also, like, you can never be too ahead of the game with a situation like mine. I think I have to arrive 30 minutes early anyway, so I don't know if I'm on track for that. Oh, 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 oh. Bro, my knee hurts. Y'all, y'all! I don't know what my dorm looks like. But if, let me tell you, follow my TikTok because you will know how my room looks like when, if you follow my TikTok, you will know exactly what my dorm looks like. Exactly, immediately. Cause I'm gonna do the TikTok. If it's bad, I'm gonna do the TikTok where it's like. What is this, honey? I was shocked, honey. I was in tears almost. And it has a. I'm gonna insert the sound right there. <laughs> No! Oh my gosh. I'm trying to be positive about the whole thing. I'm excited to see my friends that I've known for what, like six months, the few, like over the summer and like up to now, like that are going, that go to my school that I've never got to meet in person. Everybody else, we've been virtual friends. We've been Zooming, looking at each other's faces from far away and stuff like that. And it's been a really interesting experience, to say the least. Do, how am I dressed right now? My knee really feels really weird. Usually when there's something wrong with my body, it's usually a sign. Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop reading into things too much. Hopefully, me being in a new place will make me funnier. I have been feeling like... Well, I've always been funny, but like... I don't know. I feel like I'm more situationally funny. And there just hasn't been much situation going on because I have 
in fact been at home but I feel like I've been making the best out of my situation but now your boy is literally an adult that's awesome God is always coming in at the right time right when I was just having a moment my Bible verse loads up you love to see it you love to see it ah! I'm gonna be real with y'all. Like moving into college is not as flattering as it thinks. Maybe, maybe, maybe not for me, just because like we're in the middle of a panty, but for me, right now, none of this is flattering. Like all the stuff I had to fill in my car when it was 37 degrees outside, exact dude. What is my life? I know what's going on by the name of this YouTube. But I don't have to be at school until technically 8.30, technically 9. Honestly, my window is honestly between 8.30 and 10.30. But I'm trying to get there just early because, I mean, there's no reason why I shouldn't be early. Otherwise, I'm just moving on color people time. Did y'all ever read the book, A Wrinkle in Time? Were y'all so ever presently confused when y'all read that? I don't know why they recommended we read that at, in like third and fourth grade. That book was confusing. That was literally like, if y'all have seen Inception, that was like trying to read Inception in third grade. The concept of like, fiction just wasn't fictioning back in the day. Like I, I had an imagination, but the way, the way A Wrinkle in Time was written. And then what made me a little upset was the movie was almost was was it was cool it was a cool movie but it just was not an accurate depiction of like how they interpreted the book in my opinion because you got my imagination having things look one way and then the movie not look like the way it was in my imagination at that point you didn't do your job sorry oprah shout out to my girl um what is her name i know storm storm reed queen queen I love the movie though, it was really good, but it was like weird, cause you were like, and it was like, that was that was in the back of my memory. The way I imagined the movie was like, anyway, I feel like nobody can relate to what I'm talking about because who read A Wrinkle in Time in third grade? Uh, I'm literally gonna be living on a college campus. I've been living at home for the last 19 years. What is happening? Oh, we're at Publix, guys, so all my anxiety can go away. Honestly, I love you wanted to go to Target, but Beggars can't be choosers. Yeah. Today. Call JG Winsworth. 877 cash now. 877 cash now. Okay, we're done with Publix. That was a good adventure. Um, I guess it's time to start heading to the school. Yeah, we're done. Y'all ever just have like a realization that like you don't know your friend's birthday? Okay, I think I'm gonna save my battery because it's gonna be a long day. Huh, yeah, doing too much sometimes gets the best of me. I need to slow it down, help me find a recipe. Help me get back to myself, can let it get the best of me. I tell them, please stay away. I don't like your energy. I put in work. It's me being by my sister college for me. Hold on, can you see Spelman? Yeah, Bria, what's up? Um, I still don't exactly know where I'm going, but I'm on campus. Whoa, that's a big thing to say. Never said that before. I'm on campus. What is that building? Oh, Y'all, um, here's actually a fun fact. I have never been to, no, I've been, okay, so I've performed at Morehouse's campus twice. No, one time. Mm, I think twice. I've been on Morehouse football field. I've been to Morehouse Performing Arts Center. I've been to their calf when I was like three. Not even three. How old was I? Oh, we're here. Oh, we're here. If y'all want a scenic view. Hey, bestie. Hey, girl. Hey. Yep, I'm lost. I'll say it. I admit I'm lost. Um, so I will let y'all know when I get back. I don't know what's happening, but I'm in a line patiently waiting. So, here we are. 
Okay, guys, I am in the gates. Um, there goes Paco. There goes the testing center. I have to get tested. Um, oh, I think I got cut off, but last time I was here, I performed on that marching band. Or, not that marching band. I performed on that field for nationals. That's where they have the high stepping nationals. Crazy, right? Crazy. Isn't that wild? Yeah. So, yeah, that was the last time I was here. So, now I'm moving in and living here. Crazy. I'll let you know how everything goes. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. I just got my COVID test. Um, <laughs> I'm just waiting on my results. Uh, I, my nose is so sensitive. So, this is what you're seeing right now. I'm so ecstatic to be on campus or whatever, but that COVID test was not cute. There goes the stadium, though. Home to Maroon Tigers, period. Somebody should take the, like, frame image. That's a cool picture. Whew. <sighs> I'm good though, I'm good, I'm great. But anyways, um, one thing I haven't gotten done, like, asked my school about is my parking pass. Real fun stuff. To say the least. I'll talk to y'all later. Hey guys, we're at my dorm. Um, I got medical clearance, I'm about to move in. I'm not about to show you that process, it's gonna be too tedious, but I will talk to y'all later, bye. All right, guys, I finished moving in. We are on camp. Yes, sir. I got a parking pass. The jump was free. Life is good. I'm about to go show y'all my room. I have to, it's a little bit of a walk where the parking deck or where the parking, where my parking lot is versus where my dorm is, but ain't nothing too hard. It's a little trek, but I will see y'all when I get into my dorm. Let's go. I can't believe this is my life. Y'all, look at that. That's so dope. Oh my gosh, yeah. My face is gonna be somewhere on this wall soon. But yeah, I had to walk back to my dorm. So. <sighs> I'll talk to you later. We are in Tsukasa. Tsukasa Chaston. Closet one, closet two. My desk, I have to wipe everything off. Everything fits under. I'm probably gonna get a mini fridge. No, I'm probably gonna get a mini fridge. Either put it, hold on, let me just show you the room. The lighting is kind of coming in, but yeah. My dorm is nice, very sizable. It looks smaller in pictures, but it's actually pretty wide. Um, my view is pretty, pretty cool, pretty cool. That's the stadium. Those are all the halls. Uh, Graves is actually right on that side. So. The most essential part of this room, y'all will see, hold on, y'all will see. Dorm room. This is my favorite part of my room. The study nook. Still putting, hanging stuff up. I'm getting kinda sleepy, but I'm about to go eat with Paco and Miles, my dorm buddies. So yeah. Hey guys, so I'm basically done with, you know, my room, so let's do a little mini tour. You can't see it too well, but you got your colors. These are all my colors. I try to coordinate them as best as possible. Um, these are, this is my color closet, because I have two. This is my neutral closet, where my browns, grays, and blacks are in here. And then my suits are back there, but I'm gonna put them in here once I get a chance. Or in here, I don't know, I haven't decided yet. Um, my towel is, this is my little study nook. Got my desk calendar. That's what I need to turn into, to my, right? My, whatever that is, it's gonna get filled. And then I have 
down here I have my school stuff, not really important or whatever. Those are just cord. Then the main attraction, the bed. Yeah, mm -hmm. I went with this light blue. I, I didn't know how I was gonna feel about it. I love it. I love it. This is my throw blanket, my rug. And then over here we have my cabinet. I haven't filled it yet because I actually have cabinets under here. So I was over prepared. Period. My guy. Well, you see, you see, you're getting up here so quick. My guy. Up, gang. My, my guy. guy. <laughs> my guy. My guy. And to be here, welcome to my crib. Welcome to my crib. You know, we got the cup and water bottle. You know, we in here got the, got the bed. <laughs> got a little mini fridge. You ain't got nothing in it, but it's okay. Um, just stop touching stuff. Shit. Just stop touching stuff. Alright. <laughs> bro, this is my screen time, bro. Get out of here. I was just there. Bro, so get, this is my screen time, bro. Yeah. That was fun. That's the conclusion of Move-In Day 2021. Period. Bye, guys.